Earlier in the series, we tested Porsche's latest 911 Turbo. Now it's time to find out how its little brother, the Carrera 4, handles the twists and turns of the racetrack. Back in the 1980s, we had some horrible fashions. We had some very nasty music. And we also had a group of people that were called yuppies. But what did a yuppie want to do with his wads of cash? He wanted to buy one of these. Today we're at Alton Park in Cheshire to find out exactly what this car can do. Now the 911 has been accused of being too grown up, so surely the Carrera 4 must be the sensible of all Porsches. The engine produces a rather hefty 300 brake horsepower, enough to hit 60 from standstill in just a shade over 5 seconds and it will take you flying up to a wonderful 175 miles an hour. From being a little nipper, the Porsche 911 was always the car I wanted, that was the dream car for me. I just loved the way it looked, the way it sounded. And uh, not so long ago, a pal of mine bought a 993, fantastic car, makes a wonderful noise, that air-cooled engine's just fantastic. And they bring out the 996, the one we're in today is the Carrera 4. And let me tell you, with the state of the, uh, the circuit today, the Carrera 4 makes a hell of a difference. You need that four-wheel drive to pull out the bends. Cost-cutting means that the 911 has got to share a few parts with its smaller sister, the Boxster, and like it or not, this means your 60 grand supercar looks a lot like a 35,000 pound Boxster, well from the front anyway. Doesn't really bother me, but I won't be surprised if some potential buyers felt a little bit differently. The only thing for me with this car at the moment is the fact that it's just not making that noise, the noise that I used to love about the Porsche, that growl. But having said that, it drives very well. It's a, it's a refined version of the 993, I reckon. Certainly with a four-wheel drive, you can come in and out of bends so nicely. You can brake very late. You can pull out the bends with a lot of acceleration and you don't feel like the car's gonna give anything. You just know that it's just gonna grit to the road and it's gonna pull away. I'm having a lot of fun. Well, the yuppies may have been left behind in the 80s, but not so the 911. Now nearly 40 years old, the 911 continues to offer an unmatchable combination of looks, performance and drivability. If your purse strings won't loosen enough to get hold of the 911 Turbo, then the Carrera 4 is not a bad car to settle for. At just under £60,000, the Carrera isn't cheap, but what do you get for your money? It's a practical sports car that will always be in fashion. Unlike the yuppie.